Bionic implants are no longer the stuff of science fiction. The Centre for Implantable Bionics at the University of New South Wales is a new research powerhouse with the potential to revolutionise the way we treat physical impairment. We see this centre bringing a number of benefits to the state, uh, further enhancing this university, New South's strong ties with Sydney and the broader biomedical community and uh, really add to the quality of life and the quality of society and ultimately that's what we're all trying to do at the universities. Researchers at the centre are developing refined bionic hearing and artificial heart technologies, along with the ultimate goal, bionic vision. It's a dream to put in. It's, a, it's, right. a, it's like it was designed to have this, this okay. sort of thing put in. Right. And the second sight people, they go in and they, they make an incision here and they yep. put the electrode inside the eye yes. and lay it up against this, uh, the retina there. New South Wales Minister for Science and Medical Research, Verity Firth, recently opened the centre, which will build on Sydney's status as a hub of medical technology development. The merging of biology and engineering to create new and replacement parts for the human body is an enormously complex field. Implants and prosthetics are now crucial to the well-being of society and are helping people to live longer with more enjoyable lives. The Centre for Implantable Bionics places UNSW firmly in the international race to commercialise bionic vision. The challenges are substantial, but the rewards for success are enormous.